Divine Ages is an absolutely massive discipline healing ability for priests in Phase 3 of Season of Discovery, making your critical heals give shields to allies. So first to get this rune, you have to head to Fellwood in Kalimdor, and at the entrance area to Fellwood is the Emerald Sanctuary, which has this new mob here, the Sawtooth Emissary. Talking to her, she's going to give you a quest to go figure out what's going on with the old gods. She tells you you need a Whisper Wild Draught from Jinthal Alor in the Hinterlands, and then use it to speak to the spirit of a Gamagon in Razorfen Downs. Everybody in your group has to come and get this quest. You cannot share this quest. It's not a shareable quest. And then the next step, only one member of your party has to do. This is definitely a party quest line. You have to do a bunch of dungeons and stuff like that. But you definitely only need one person to have the drought from the hinterland. So if you're lucky enough to have somebody else get it, that's good to go. Otherwise, you gotta head over there. So to get the Wild Whisper Draught, we're headed here to Jintha Alor in the hinterlands. And we have to kill these elite enemies. They have a chance to drop our draught, but it's just such a pain in the butt. Hopefully you can get some friends to help you out, or you might want to try to make sure you're max level 50 before you do this. Once you have the Wild Lizard draught, you're headed to Razor Fen Downs. This is a five-man dungeon in Southern Barrens. Once in the dungeon, you're probably max level, so you want to take the right path and skip directly to the boss. The dungeon isn't that hard. If you have one person that's kind of tanky, you can probably come in with two or three DPS, and you should be able to clear your way through all of this. You don't really need a healer, but if you got one, it makes it that much easier. So stop rogues and druids from having an unfair advantage. They made it so you have to have all of the nearby enemies at the top cleared out. You have to have fully cleared out this large pack, which you can't really do solo, and you actually have to kill the boss, who is a little bit of a pain in the butt. Once you've killed the last boss, use the Whis Wild Whisper Draught in your bag. Drinking that will summon the spirit of a Gamagon, who you can come, talk to, and complete the quest. This will receive a new item, catch the attention of Delirious Ancient, drawing it into combat. A darkness has taken root in the Emerald Dream, and it has shadowed the ancient spirits of Hyjal with confusion and fear. Deliver wild offerings to Shadowtooth Emissary in Fellwood. So we've got to pick ourselves up some wild offerings from out in the world. This means that we have to go to a couple of different dungeons. You can do the same dungeon multiple times or go to different dungeons depending on how you feel like doing this. In Zulfarak, you will find the spider in the room around the pool where Gazrilla spawns. The spider mob will be wandering around here. It's a level 53 elite and relatively easy to take down. You will have to take out three of the bosses before the spider spawns. We recommend the cave boss, the stairs, and the chief. In Maradin, you're going to find the giant T-Rex after you defeat Princess. Upon defeating her, he's going to be wandering around this outer area of water, and you just need to use the horn to activate him and take him down. In Blackrock Depths, you can find the shadowy figure in the path towards the giant stone elemental. So when you enter into the dungeon, head left and go through the locked gate. That will lead you down to this long path with lines of dwarven mobs around the outside. This guy is going to be wandering up and down here, heading towards that big stone elemental. This guy's a pain in the butt. He's quite strong, and there's so many strong packs of mobs that you have to take down to take this guy out. I really wouldn't recommend you farming your offerings off of this guy. Once you get all three wild offerings, you're going to make your way back to Fellwood at the Emerald Sanctuary. You're going to go up to the Emissary and hand in that quest, and she'll give you an item that will teach you your brand new rune. I hope this guy helped you out. I'm Zetty Fresh from Games, and we'll catch you guys next time.